Welcome back to Ships Tech Talk. Today, we're diving into the commonly used drive in ships for controlling electrical motors. Variable frequency drives. Variable frequency drives are devices used to control the speed and torque of electric motors by varying the motor input frequency and voltage. They play a critical role in enhancing the efficiency and performance of motor-driven systems. This VFD can convert single-phase input power having 200 to 240 AC voltage and 50 to 60 Hz into three-phase AC power having 0 to 600 Hz variable frequency. Furthermore, this VFD model is suitable for a motor with 0.75 kW rated power, operating principle of VFD. The rectifier converts the fixed frequency AC power supply into DC power. The DC power is then smoothed out using capacitors. The inverter converts the smooth DC power back into a C power with a variable frequency and voltage. This variable frequency is generated by electronically switching power electronic devices, such as IGBTs or GTOs, in the inverter. The AC power with variable frequency and voltage is then supplied to the motor. VFDs have control systems that allow precise adjustments of motor speed and torque according to the requirements of the application. Advantages of using VFDs VFDs reduce energy consumption by adjusting the motor speed to match the load requirements, leading to significant energy savings. They provide precise control over motor speed and torque, enhancing process control and performance. By controlling the acceleration and deceleration of motors, VFDs reduce mechanical stress on equipment, prolonging their lifespan. Lower energy consumption and reduced wear and tear lead to cost savings in both energy bills and maintenance. VFDs improve the power factor of the system, reducing the reactive power demand on the electrical supply. Uses in ships and the maritime sector? VFDs are used in electric propulsion systems to control the speed of propulsion motors, providing smooth and efficient control over the vessel's speed. VFDs control the speed of various pumps, optimizing their performance and reducing energy consumption. VFDs adjust the speed of fans and blowers in HVAC systems, ensuring optimal ventilation and temperature control while minimizing energy use. VFDs provide precise control over winches and cranes used for cargo handling, enhancing operational safety and efficiency. In dynamic positioning systems, VFDs control the speed and direction of thrusters, improving maneuverability and stability of the vessel. In the maritime sector, the integration of VFDs into various systems helps achieve better energy efficiency, enhanced control, and reduced operational costs, contributing to more sustainable and cost-effective maritime operations. Now, I have a small favor to ask. If you have learned anything new from this video, please like it. If you have any questions or want to share your opinion with us, please leave a comment below. Spread the joy. Share this awesome video with your crew. Subscribe to our channel and enable notifications to watch straightforward and informative videos like this one, focusing on future ship technology. Thanks for tuning in.